What if you find a watch in the sand? You walk in down the beach, huh? And you find a watch. What is the first thing that comes to mind? One of two things. One is a logical answer, and the other one is an illogical answer. Although the atheists claim otherwise. Logically, the illogical, let's begin with the illogical. The illogical is, whoa, how in the world did this watch come here? Huh? How did it come together? Was it manufactured by chance? Was there an explosion up in the skies? And then a, a, a watch came about and it just happens to be lying on the beach? Now, this is, we, we say this is illogical. Even if it happened a million times, million explosions, that will never happen. Logically, you will say, I wonder who was here and who forgot or dropped or lost his watch. No human being can deny that, logically speaking. So we're saying this because we're trying to say, look, to say that there may be a God or there may be the non-existence of God is something that is nonsensical slash illogical. Look at the creation. If you refuse to believe that a watch came into existence by mere chance, then how can one look around him, see everything and the way the universe is functioning, including yourself, you the son of Adam, this complicated, sophisticated machine that does not need batteries or electricity or anything of this nature. How you function, how you move, how you understand, how you see, how you hear. How could this come into existence without an originator, without a designer for the design? We say, this is illogical. So then there must be a creator. There must be a creator. It's impossible according to all, even Plato and Aristotle, these are the most famous philosophers. They argued that there must be a God. The most famous philosophers, which people follow their footsteps to deny God, they themselves concluded that there's no way that there's not a God. Now they didn't believe in God Islamically, they didn't have the right belief system in terms of the other elements of the Tawheed, but they said, look, there must be a God. And so we say to anyone who has some sort of doubt, how is it possible that everything came into existence without a manufacturer? If your cell phone, if your recorder, if a pen cannot suddenly exist without someone who is designing it, then obviously and more likely the rest of the creation cannot be brought into existence by mere chance, whether you call it the Bing, Big Bang Theory or anything else. Planets cannot collide or some energy ball cannot explode and bring about all of us. Is it possible? It's impossible. So that must be understood as a foundation.